The city's haunted, but you still want it. The side streets full of broken hearted girls in the morning with no warning. They come creeping back to each street corner. So me and Matt are just chilling and come to visit Eagle Beach today. Is it number three in the Caribbean? Yeah. Number three top beaches in the Caribbean. An interesting fact about their sand here, it's all broken coral, which is why you can walk on it and your feet don't burn. And like when you go to Spain or other places like Dubai, the sand is so hot. But I, was, I thought it was weird that the sand wasn't hot, but it's because the coral absorbs all the heat, which is why it's actually really cool sand. But yeah, and they use but then that, tiles in the hotels. and around the pools in the hotels, they use coral tiles so you're not burning your feet before getting in the pool. I don't know if you can hear me because it's really, Aruba's really windy, isn't it? But it's yeah. so nice because it's so hot, you really need the um, wind. <sighs> The only thing is though, with it all be broken down coral, when the wind blows the sand at you, it's quite painful, isn't it? Yeah. Really quite painful. It really hurts. Anyway, we're just chilling. Everyone else is having a walk. Matt and Emily are at the sea, and Gary, Sheena, and Olivia are walking along the beach and exploring. Hey, Matt. Hey, guys. <laughs> the tan is not coming along that well. We are day what? I don't know, seven. Seven into this trip. I did think I was Oh my word, yeah, we came this time last week. I did think I was gonna be a little bit more tan than this, but um not doing so great, but it's okay. I'd rather put a higher factor on and keep my skin safe and young. <laughs> Who wants wrinkly skin, eh? As we're going on a party bus tonight and we don't have that long before we go, we've all decided to order Domino's and apparently it's here, so I'm super excited. I'm excited to try what a Rubian Domino's tastes like. Here it is. Oh my word, white boxes. Wow. Oh yes. Oh wow. That looks so good. That Domino's was absolutely delicious. It did slightly taste different than um, the Domino's in UK, but it was still really nice. Um, I'm all ready now for the party bus. I wasn't gonna take my vlog camera just in case. I lose it because we're on and off a bus for four hours um, going into some bars and I'm not too sure what it's going to be like. So I might film some stuff on my phone, so if I have, I'll insert them here. This is a t-shirt dress that I got from Brandy Melville. I'm not too sure if they have it anymore. They do tend to keep the same outfits in the shop for a long time, but that's Brandy Melville. So it should be a fun evening and uh, I'll speak to you later. Bye guys. Are you ready to party? Yeah. I can hear you. It's really hot today, we're having a cool morning and we're gonna go to the beach. I think we might even try jet ski, might we? <laughs> and then we are going to a place called Matthew's tonight. Um, hopefully it's good. We're only going because Matt's called Matthew and that Matt's called Matthew, so that's why we're going. <laughs> really hot. Just listening to some music and sunbathing. Ah. Me and Matt are just heading to the little shop. We live in Merlot Villas and the mini market is literally opposite. It's so good. If we didn't have it, we'd be in trouble, wouldn't we? 
Yeah, even though it's a small supermarket, it's actually quite good. It's got well. loads. And we're just picking up some bread rolls for lunch. Chino and Gary went and got some cheese and salad bits. Mm, and we need to pick up I'm more sun cream as well. More sun cream because we've all run out. Oh, hello. Ooh, what a nice car. Is that a Hummer? Yeah. H2. My favourite car. Nice. Here is our go-to lunch on holiday. We've got some bread rolls, cheese. That cheese is amazing. And we've got some dips and some crisps. And some salad. And some salad, yeah. A little bit of health. <laughs> Sheena and Gary's 30th wedding anniversary at Matthew's Bar. We're mainly bar. here because Matt's called Matthew and the other Matt's called Matthew. We're just walking. Look at this sunset. Because there's a sunset. That's a really nice light, wasn't it? So Sheen has gone for chocolate mousse, but shaped like little mice. How cute! Got chocolate chips for the eyes and the nose. Oh! And then me and Matt, because we're pretty full, we're just sharing a creme brulee. We're at lunch, and Matt's ordered the biggest beer ever. Look at that! Matt's got one as well. Matt's got one. And he's got even more than me. Look. <laughs> When you put it, when you put it by your head, <laughs> avocado fritters, fritters, they say, don't they? <laughs> Those should be two and five, they're so good, don't they? Just wanted to vlog quickly. It is our last full night here in Aruba and we're about to go out for dinner. The other day when we went on a Jeep bus tour, the bouncy one, we saw a really nice restaurant by the lighthouse. So that is where we're going to tonight. So hopefully the view is going to be really lovely. Just to do a quick outfit of the evening. I got this top from Topshop just before coming on holiday and I absolutely love it. It wasn't expensive at all either. Um, I got some blue jeans on. These might be a bad decision because it's still really hot, but I didn't really pack enough evening clothes. I didn't think we were gonna be eating out as much as we have done. So I'm gonna be hot. <laughs> Matt is wearing a lovely blue shirt. <laughs> and up, well, I've actually chosen to go for. Look at the messy room. I've actually chosen to wear heels tonight. Oh no, we're actually matching. <laughs> Just to feel a bit more dressy. My foot's really patterned, isn't it? Yeah. But yes, here is my top. I love it. And of course, my palm earrings that I love so much. We are here, and it's beautiful, isn't it? It's so nice. It Look almost. The lighthouse, oh, especially in that with light. This, with the sun on it as well, it looks so nice. Yeah, and outside, I'll show you our view in a minute. It almost seems like um, we're in Italy, or I think Sarah said Tuscany. I don't think I've actually been there, but yeah. it's absolutely beautiful. So nice. And here's the lighthouse. Did it have a name or anything? California Lighthouse. California Lighthouse.
usually, usually with risotto, it's such a small portion. <laughs> ready to leave but I thought I'd give you a quick house tour before we leave. I'll start from the front door. So as you come in we've got an entrance hall with a rather large vase there. We've got a more of a formal seating area. It's really cool because in here I think from the past people staying here they've left loads of books that they don't want. Whoa look at all the books. And then as you turn to the right, we've got the dining area. And there were eight of us, and luckily there were eight chairs. And then we have the kitchen. Because it's so bright outside, it's so dark in here, but um, it's actually quite light in here. We've got dishwasher, sink. We cooked scrambled egg on toast a few times over here. And then we've got the fridge and the microwave. And then we've got the living room. And then let me take you outside. So we have dining table and chairs. Got a lovely pool. It's not the biggest pool, but actually you can fit all of us in there and it's pretty deep, so it's really nice. Then we've got a sofa area, loads. Oh my word, we steamed up. This always happens on some people's vlogs that I watch and it never happens on mine so I feel like now I'm in a hot enough country. Um, yes, we've got some deck chairs here. Hello. Hello. There's mine and Matt's room up there. We've got a really nice balcony that wraps all the way around. So we've got, it's all steamed up, you can hardly see anything. So we've got loads of deck chairs and look around here, it's actually really big around the side. I feel like they should have grassed it so we could actually use it because these stones are so painful on the feet. We got a barbecue. We had a nice barbecue the other day. Oh dear. So that is the garden area. Pool's really nice. Down here we have Sarah and Olivia's room. Better view onto the beach. Oh, this has been cleaned. It smells very nice. Then up we go. Then up here we have three more rooms. This was Gary and Sheena's room. Got a nice balcony. Here was Emily and Matt's room. Oh, they had art above their bed. And then finally, Hello. our room. Our balcony was amazing, wasn't it? Got a little table and chairs. And then the bathroom. Pretty decent size actually. And here's our balcony. And we're actually on a really nice 
compound with all of the houses looking almost exactly the same. We're in Merlot Villas. And there are our taxis waiting to pick us up. 